What are you laughing at, dumbass? <laughs> Stupid, dirty joke. Gross. What's the difference between you and the refrigerator? Mm. The refrigerator doesn't moan when I put my meat in it. <laughs> Wow. Uh, hey, welcome back to our stupid drag suits with Corbin. I'm a refrigerator. And you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter, 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 Sadly, <laughs> um, I'm, it's just, yeah, it is what it is, isn't it? Somebody the other day, and I don't, we have a bunch of wonderful patrons, but somebody. Oh, mine are magnificent, except some, this, this one was recent, was on for a few days and is just evidencing mental instability that is not good for public forums. Yeah, but they uh, asked me to block them. <laughs> I was like, okay. <laughs> so, so they could say that Corbin Miles blocked me? Well, they were like, oh, I'm, I tried to unsubscribe, but the notifications keep coming up. Block me. Oh, okay. I, <laughs> I thought they wanted to, like, have the moment the way you wanted Nawaz to call you Marachod. I do want Nawaz to call yeah, me Marachod. He has. I want him to do it again. Over and over again. But more sensually. Yes. Today we got a new teaser that dropped. Mm. And it's by one Ranveer Singh. Who's that? He is the only reason this channel exists. Actually. It's true. And we should actually call it our Ranveer reaction. Hey, hey. Think about it, kids. What was the first reaction we had to anything Indian? Gully Boy. It was the Gully Boy. So, uh, so you can thank him. Yeah, and uh, uh, who's tattoo? Uh, who said these words? Uh, so, I mean, we. I mean, we do about fifteen uh, reactions a week for Renvir. And yes, it's because of. I don't know who sends more if it's him or. Karen Johar, we should weigh it, but the amount of cocaine we yeah, got. We get a lot. It's a lot from so both of good. them. So. Anyways, his new uh, a teaser, I think it's more of like a, a teaser for the trailer. You're not seeing anything from the actual movie. Uh, it's more of like they're teasing got it. stuff with a bunch of different characters, but got it's it. for his new upcoming comedy, Circus, uh, directed by Rohit Shetty, who is Excellent. Uh, known for big, over-the-top Entertainers, yeah. So you're you're not gonna get anything really. This uh, isn't high cinema no. artistry. This no, is no, just it's entertainment. Ball, balls to the wall yeah. comedy is what comedy I'm, and entertainment. I'm understood. Rock and roll. And in this, it says uh, this it references a lot of famous characters, famous dialogue from Rohit Shetty's comedy movies. Uh, so things are lost in translation. Got and it. it was uh, subbed by uh, Hamanchu, one of our subbers. Thank you so thank much. You, because thank you, Hamanchu. for some reason, T Series was like, no, we don't need subtitles. We're only the biggest. Fucking destroy. Anyways, it pisses me off when <laughs> the largest <laughs> production house in India just was like, no, nah. we don't need English subtitles. <laughs> what? Anyways, thank you, Hamanchu. Uh, but if anything's wrong with it, which attack so him with visceral anger. Which is so strange because so many Indians speak English, but they don't necessarily speak Hindi. Hindi so it would make sense to just put an English subtitle at least for them. Yeah, very strange. Anyways, yeah. but here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, hey. welcome to 60s. We know him too. I think these are characters from prior films. Breaking news. stories Basically, circus was a film of life simple thing. Because the Social media ke likes nahi. Arey, lekin sabko ye batao circus a kab rahi hai. Arey, ye to sabko pata hai circus Christmas par aari hai. Haan, trailer ka baare ye batao. Hmm, meherban kadardan tham ye dil sambhal ye hoosh kyunki circus ka trailer aayega, bahut jald aayega. Nakhre dikha me jaldi bol, kal subeh panvel nikalna hai. Circus ka trailer aayega second December. Lekin aap ko le jayega sita 1960s me. Bilkul sahi kaam mere garibo ke malinga. Chalinga, chalinga. Wait. Was that um, Johnny Lever? Oh, wow. Was it really? Why am I... I have so many qu questions. Thank you so much, Hamanchu. Yeah, Hamanchu. Um, Thank you. So obviously it's setting up this world of obviously they're setting up for the 60s. So before technology. And there's clearly a twin. 
yeah. element going on here. Yeah. That's that's a huge thing in Indian cinema, just playing the double roles. Yeah. It's 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 been here a few times, but it's like not like a normal thing. It is like if no. you're a big actor, you've had to have played a double role at some, some point, point in your career. Yeah. Why? It's very interesting because yeah, I could off the top of my head count on one hand double role characters from TV and film. It's not a common thing. No. At all. Maybe it's just like, oh, you get double the star. Maybe that's what it is. So, like, I guess everybody goes for their stars, especially if it's two, two, two stars in one. Yeah. So, if like VJ plays two different roles, you get double the VJ in the film. I guess. I don't know. But obviously, it goes way back till early Bollywood as well. No. Um, of all these different things. But yeah, I thought I saw it. And I had another question. Um, maybe Androni can help me with it. Um, about. A, a certain look of a certain character maybe it's it's In the guy general, the guy or? with the beanie oh i've seen that look a lot wait Topeka's in it is she just a is it just a cameo holy wow shit balls look at these look at wow this. <laughs> there's quite the cast here and yes there's johnny lever johnny lever okay that was him right the big uh the big hair guy this guy this is who i was yeah yeah is that him? him it's gotta be okay that big smile under that hair. Yeah, I thought so. You, you, and then I, I recognize a lot Ranveer, of Ranveer, Pooja Hegde. I recognize a lot of the actors, actually, in terms of like just little supporting roles. Yeah. Uh, so I'm wondering if a lot of them are just big old comedy actors. Uh, Johnny Lever as Johnny and, Lever. And my suspicion, obviously, I'm guessing maybe these actors were in previous films or they're even reprising uh, from the characters. Chetis. Yeah, from his prior, prior films. Um, a circus operator and his gymnast friends belong to a big circus company juggle with their lives and try to bring back the extinct circus culture to the public okay so obviously he's part of the circus and he's a twin that was, used to be a big thing for must be circuses um back in the day yeah i'm assuming the circus in india would be comparable to the circus in america but i may be way off base I've, I would haven't the foggiest idea what well, the circus is like in well, India. It's definitely dead now. Yeah. That's for sure. Did y'all ever have a big circus culture in India ever? Yeah. It's, I mean, same kind of thing? Same kind of thing, but you, it's not big as uh, Cirque du Soleil here. Right. No, but it was, I had like elephants but it did. back yeah, in the yeah, day. Yeah. Did you have kind of Ringling stuff. Brothers Barnum and Bailey Circus there? Uh -huh. Ah, then no. There were really only two circuses here in the United States when I was a kid. Ringling Brothers Barnum and Bailey Circus or Circus Vargas. We had different names. I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm sure. But yeah, I remember going um, to circuses when I was a kid, and it would have ele I vividly remember clowns and elephants. Clowns, elephants. Okay, so it's the, the same lion thing. tamer. Same kind of thing. Ja yeah. So trapeze it, artists, some yes. fire eaters. Sure, sure, same kind of thing. Oh, this is the other. So th this look. Yeah. What is that look from? Because like the the beanie that's all the way around the head with the kind of up at top, I recognize that look. That's who I'm talking about. Do you like? Is that an iconic? No. I, Why do I? I just seen it a few times too, and it's in comedy stuff. Yeah, it's like it's specifically in comedy. Maybe even it wasn't like, what was it? What was that? Um, the the Gomal. Was it in Gomal? Oh, I don't know. That, that's the one I'm talking about. I'm, I'm just trying to figure out, is that like an iconic comedy character? Right. And that's what they're trying to emulate? Right. It's a pretty distinct kind of look, right? Yeah, it is. Um, but they, yeah, Sanjay Mistra. <laughs> Fun. I like him a lot. When I think he's a fantastic actor. He is. Like he's, he's Oscar level. Mm -hmm. But I feel like he also loves to do... These silly balls to the wall silly comedy. Why wouldn't you? Yeah, How like, fun <laughs> would that be? <laughs> like he could be like Irfan, right? <laughs> right. In that level of um, dramatic, beautiful artistry. Not to say right. that this is not beautiful artistry. Comedy is harder <laughs> in general. In many respects, yeah. Maybe that's why. Maybe, maybe. he likes the challenge, or maybe it's he also likes just a lot of fun. Maybe he also likes he does these ones to fund his could be more artistic yep. side, kind of like a Nasserdin Shah. Yeah, could be. Um, and that kind of stuff. I don't know. Uh, so I, I think the trailer comes out on, it said the second. So that's what. Also that guy. Why do I know him? Yeah. The guy with the big Elvis hair. Don't you feel like. Oh, yeah. He looks very familiar. Very familiar, right? Um, my hope is that we'd be able to get all the comedy. 
Right. It's because obviously, if you go into this, you're 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 just expecting balls to the wall, just silly, ridiculous, silly fun. comedy. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and we can get comedy, but if it's all dialogue or like reference driven, and uh, the yeah. subtitles do not do it justice, and culture driven, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that would always be my fear. Yeah, I don't know if that's what this is. We'll see what the trailer looks like because yeah. obviously this isn't even from the film. Um, but yeah, you guys let us know. Uh, obviously, those questions I had, please answer those so I can understand them and uh what you think about the trailer and what should what uh, what do uh, are you excited for it's coming out on Chris 23rd yeah the 23rd so right right, right at, at christmas what day is christmas this year it's always december 25th i i know that what day of the week um no idea that's why it's on the sunday so Obviously, they're not going to drop it on Christmas. So that's releasing on a Friday. On Friday. Yeah. Um, Christmas weekend, which is what's going to be for everybody who opens that weekend. Which I find so funny. They were smart that India has, like, Christmas releases. But, I mean, I know there's a big population of Christians in India. I'm not saying, I'm not saying that. But it's not like a holier Diwali in terms of the no. magnitude. Yeah. Like, I'd say probably less than half probably celebrate Christmas. Yeah. And Johnny? How often do you celebrate Christmas when you were in India? Well, I always did because it was just. But did a lot of people have lights up trees or oh, anything like that? Calcutta's decked oh, really? out. I had like a small Christmas tree every 25th December, and it's a ritual in my house to go uh, to New Market and have plum cake for Christmas. Because of the song? I don't know. That's a very. Like, I've actually never had plum cake. But neither have I. Cake. Every 25th December, we would go and get plum cake, and sometimes we would go to church and see all the lights okay. being lit. So I so the, there's a big like yeah lighting yeah. of well, lights and trees and stuff. Yes. Okay. Then so I guess that makes sense. Yeah, she would send me video and show me the decorations on the streets. Granted, here it's not really a Christian thing. It's just this is just an American culture, the Christmas wise. Obviously, I'm not saying Christians a, don't have their reasons. No, I'm not saying is, that it's much bigger than it's that. It's not really about. Jesus, in terms of the whole of America celebrating, the it's, whole of America takes it as a no, season of goodwill, season of goodwill and, and fun generosity and giving, and, giving yeah. and, and that kind of stuff. Exactly. Obviously, it has religious, uh, of course, stuff behind but it. You, no, you're absolutely but right. But that's not the main reason people celebrate Christmas. There's people that are, aren't religious in the At slightest all. that celebrate Christmas. In fact, it's probably it's more of a pagan holiday actually. Than yeah, it's, it's <laughs> probably it's by far the biggest holiday here in terms of shopping and everybody celebrating. But it's also probably the biggest holiday we have that does have a religious religious origin that the majority celebrate for completely oh, yeah. not religious reasons. Yeah. Yeah. One, Jesus um, wasn't even born in but, December. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Newsflash, he was not born in, in the dead of winter. He just wasn't. It's a lie. And also, there are no wise men in the real manger scene, in case you didn't know that. The wise oh. men showed up when he was two. No, no, they So didn't. They were there. Um, Mer. The, the, uh, they're smart, because if they released that a week earlier, that wouldn't be wise. Because on December 16th is okay. when the new Avatar comes out. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but they are marketing this heavily to, I've seen promotions already for like, bring the family. Yeah. It's a, a big, big Christmas family Christmas movie. Christmas family. Which, that's a big deal. We've yeah. mentioned this before. Yeah. It is a big deal to a lot of people have as a tradition after they open the gifts <sighs> is to go to the movies and see a Christmas film. It used to be our tradition. Me too. Before. We used uh, to do it. Before, all the time. Before kids. And it will be again. It will be. <laughs> but, yeah, but you open up the gifts, and then middle afternoon, it's, hey, let's all go as a family to a matinee. Yep. Anyways, let us know what you thought about the teaser uh, and any other information we need to know down below. Josh!